Ladies and gentlemen, good afternoon to all of you, and welcome to the Friends of 13 50th Anniversary Celebration. Channel 13 became a nonprofit public television station back in 1962, and it was very shortly after that that a number of volunteers stepped up and began fundraising to be sure that the station could create and produce the type of programming that we have all become so enamored of during the course of those years. The group, as they became more organized, became known as the Friends of 13. And for the last 50 years, they have been an absolutely invaluable resource for us in allowing public television to thrive in the tri-state area. The Friends of 13 date their official creation to 1968. That year, they were able to raise $67,000 for Channel 13. Give you a sense of context here. $67,000 then, roughly the equivalent of half a million dollars today that they did as part of those volunteer efforts. We want you to learn a little bit more about them as we celebrate them today. And to do that, we are delighted to welcome to the podium to learn more about the Friends of 13, two distinguished members of their board of directors. Please welcome Catherine Connors and Carmela Hacklish. Thank you all for coming and supporting the Friends of 13, WNET, our sister stations, WLIW and NJTV. It is an honor and a privilege to be associated with each one of them. Friends of 13 is a separate nonprofit organization whose goal is to serve as the communication link between our local communities and these stations to spread the word about programming, educational and outreach activities, and of course, to fundraise to support the efforts of these stations. It's pretty incredible that over the course of the past 30 years, the mission of the Friends has remained the same. It is necessary, it is noble, and I think we all feel that public media is more important today than ever. Thank you. I just want to say that uh, as we begin um, our gathering here and celebration together, that I am reminded of uh, something I heard Ken Burns uh, mention in an interstitial, I think it was over the past summer, and he called PBS and Channel 13 our nation's neighborhood, and I loved that image. And so it is such a pleasure for Kathy and me on behalf of the friends and the whole PBS family to welcome you all here today. We're gonna have a great time. Thank you for joining us.